What's going on? I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the new script hook along with Simple Trainer to go along with it. Um, the links will be in the, the description. So we're just going to click download on this file. Then we're going to go to Simple Trainer and we're just going to click download. Download. Once you have those two files open, we're going to exit out of this. We're going to go into our OpenIV. And we're going to hit edit mode. And then if this is your first time um, opening OpenIV, you're going to get options that say, would you like to install blah, blah, blah up here, click yes, and then it's going to say, do you want to install a mods folder, do you want to install um, free camera and something else, um, hit all, click yes to all of those, and that's all you need to do for OpenIV, and then you can just click exit, and then we are going to open up our Grand Theft Auto directory, if you guys do not know where your GTA directory is, um, Let's open up Steam, because that's where I have it downloaded. And we're going to go to our library. <clears throat> then we are going to go to our Grand Theft Auto. And we could right click on it and go to properties. And then we're going to go to local files and click browse. And then this will show you your Grand Theft Auto directory. So once we have our Grand Theft Auto directory up, open, we're going to open up the script hook uh, file we just downloaded. It's going to be right here. And we're going to want these two files right here. So we're just going to drag and drop. We're going to drag and drop. Exit out of that, and then we're going to go to the simple trainer file we just downloaded. We're going to open that up. We're going to copy these two files right here. You could open this README right here, and this shows you all the features that are inside this trainer, along with the controls. But we're just going to be installing it, so we're going to drag these two files. We're going to drop. I already have them installed, so I'm going to click replace and now they are installed so we're gonna go into the game and make sure that it is working so we're going to launch our Grand Theft Auto remember Rage Hook is still not updated for the recent contract update by Grand Theft Auto so we're still gonna have to wait a little bit to play our LSPDFR but if you do have a backup of your LSPDFR um, then you're all set but I don't, so I'm just going to wait a little bit, and I don't mind. You cannot um, play with this menu online, else you will be banned, or you have the risk of being banned. So we're going to click story mode. You know, we are going to wait for this to load in real quick. So for simple trying out to work, uh, it needs script hook and uh, the din put file that we drag and drop. So if our menu doesn't open, then that means we didn't do something right. So, I'm going to click F3 to open my menu. That works good. You can see everything is working. And we are good to go with our new script hook and simple trainer. So, until next time guys, peace.